Hi friends, Victor Costa, Peace, Love and Muscles. Hope you're doing well. Back at it again, showing uh, the proper technique for an overhead press. And I'm showing here an improper technique. I'm showing that oftentimes we begin this exercise in our zeal to bring the weights up. Uh, we often begin the exercise with this connection and thrust from the rear, from the uh, trapezius. Now, although this looks like a, probably a pretty keen exercise for some kind of a new trap exercise, what we're trying to do here is really exemplify and show the improper way to connect with the shoulders in an overhead press. Now I'm expressing here that when I thrust the weight up unconsciously, the first thing that's going to move is my traps. I'm going to connect with the traps and they're going to rise. The exercise is going to get pushed into that particular area of my body and it's going to take the resistance away or it's going to take the pressure away from the shoulders and it's going to arrest a full contraction. It's going to keep me from getting a full contraction from my for my shoulders. So what I want to do really is to relax those traps. Um, it takes a little time to be able to do this but what I want to do is work around them. I want to push around the traps. So the first move in an overhead press should never be to let the traps rise and arrest your, your uh, full range of motion. You can see here that that's the difference, right? I'm showing here that the traps do not have to be involved in this exercise. When you move the weights consciously with the shoulders, allowing the pressure uh, from the hands to sit into the shoulders, if you will, really make that connection, build that dialogue with the shoulders before you begin to press. If I just thrust the weights overhead, of course, if I do it unconsciously, what's going to happen is my body again will mobilize to get the weights from point A to point B, and I won't be able to connect with my shoulders. You can see here that the traps are not rising, as in the first uh, beginning of the movement when I showed you how to do the exercise improperly. So that's really it, guys. That's what I wanted to share with you today. I wanted to show you that there is a way to do this, to work around the traps to not get the traps involved and to have a full range of motion without letting the traps arrest that movement. So thank you so much for watching and listening. I really appreciate the likes, the shares, and the subs. Please follow me on Instagram and Facebook at VixNatural. And thank you so much, guys. Peace, love, and muscles. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.